This faceless YouTube channel known as Nature Lens has been estimated by Social Blade to generate a monthly revenue of $149,000 just by making extremely simple YouTube shorts. In this video, I'll show you how you can use AI tools like Canva, ChatGPT, and Murph.ai to create similar content for free. This could help you kickstart your own faceless YouTube channel and begin making serious money. But first, let's take a closer look at one of the videos from Nature Lens. This is one of the slowest and laziest animals in the world. Meet the sloth, the cute slow motion furball. Sloths are a group of neotropical mammals with six different species. Basically, this channel generates views by sharing interesting facts about animals. Although the channel was launched less than a year ago, it has successfully attracted over 274 million views. And all of its videos are short videos. You can also create great videos like this too. Let's get started. Let's kick things off with our AI-powered script writing tool, ChatGPT. First things first, create an account and log in. Now for the sake of this tutorial, let's ask ChatGPT to help us out with a list of 10 interesting animals found in China. Alright, you get to choose your favorite animal from this list. For this video, I'm all in for the adorable panda. We'll then ask ChatGPT to generate a script of around 50 to 70 words packed with fascinating facts about pandas. Now, just a little note here. For this tutorial, we're keeping the script on the shorter side just to illustrate the process. However, when you're creating your own YouTube shorts, feel free to extend your script up to 125 to 150 words. Bear in mind, YouTube shorts are generally up to 60 seconds long, so make every word count. Once we have our script, the next step is to breathe life into it with a voiceover. This is where Murph.ai, one of the best text-to-speech software in my opinion, comes into play. To get started, simply Google Murph.ai. If you are a new user, click on Sign Up. You have the option to sign up using your Google, Microsoft, or Slack account, or you can register using your email ID and password. Upon signing up, you'll receive an email from Murph.ai. Click on Open Studio to get started. If you've already signed up, just hit the login button and proceed to Open Studio. Next, click on Create Project. Let's name our project. I'm going to go with audio, and I'm going to start blank. Click create project, and you'll be directed to a new page. Here you'll see a selection of voice options that Murph offers. They have a wide range of languages and accents to choose from. English, US, and Canada, UK, Australia, and many more. You can also filter the voices based on gender. In total, you can pick from over 120 voices across more than 20 languages. Let's hear some of them. Did you know that three in four products in the supermarket are wrapped in plastic? Hello, I am Edward. I come from the UK. My style is simple and conversational. Alright, I'm going to select Edward as his voice sounds similar to the voiceover in the Nature Lens video we saw earlier. To generate the voiceover, paste your script into the provided field and click Generate Audio. Once the audio generation is complete, you can play it back to ensure it sounds just the way you want. Did you know that pandas, despite being classified as carnivores, primarily eat bamboo? They can consume up to 40 pounds of bamboo per day. Once you're happy with it, click export in the top right corner, then click download to save your file. Next up, we need to grab some eye-catching visuals to bring our script and voiceover to life. Now you may be thinking, where can I find copyright-free video footage for my YouTube shorts? There are plenty of free stock footage websites out there, just like the ones I'm showing right now. Feel free to visit any of these websites and download the footage that suits your needs. My personal favorite is canva.com. Now it's time to bring all our elements together and start crafting a fantastic YouTube short using Canva. First off, head over to canva.com. You can simply type it into Google or use the link I provided in the description. If you're new to Canva, no worries, just sign up. If you are already a member, go ahead and log in. Once you are in, select mobile video. Now on the left side of your screen, you'll see the uploads tab. Click on it. Then hit upload files and bring in the voiceover you created with murph.ai. Simply drag and drop it onto the timeline. With the voiceover in place, let's add some visual magic. Click on the Elements tab. Here you'll discover a wide range of graphics, shapes, and much more that you can easily drag onto your canvas. Next up, we need some video footage. Click on the Videos tab and you'll be greeted with a vast collection of stock videos. Use the search bar if you have something specific in mind. For our panda video, I'll type in panda. Once you found a clip you love, just drag it onto your canvas. Alternatively, you can download free video footage from the websites I showed earlier and upload those files to Canva. To make your video more engaging, consider adding captions. You can do this by going to the Text tab and clicking on Add a Text Box. Alternatively, you can use the Canva Assistant located on the right side of the screen. 
just click on Add Text Box. Once you've added your text box, you can choose the font style, size, and color that fits your video. To make your YouTube shorts more dynamic and interesting, consider adding transitions between your clips. Don't sweat if your video clips are a bit longer than your voiceover. Canva allows you to trim videos. Just click on the video on your timeline, then adjust the ends of the bar that appears to fit the length of your voiceover. Once you've got your visuals and voiceover in place, it's time to add some background music to your video. For this, YouTube Audio Library is a fantastic resource. Here's how you can find it. First, sign into YouTube Studio. From the left menu, select Audio Library. Here, you will find a wide range of free music that you can use in your videos. You can use the search bar to find a specific genre, mood, or artist, or simply browse through the library at your leisure. When you find a track you like, hit the play button to preview it. If it's the perfect fit for your video, click on the download icon next to the track to save it to your device. Now return to Canva, similar to how we added the voiceover. You'll want to upload your downloaded soundtrack and drag it onto the timeline. You can adjust the volume of the soundtrack by selecting it in the timeline, and then clicking on the speaker icon to adjust the volume. Once you're happy with your video, it's time to save it. Click on the Share button, and select Download to save it onto your PC. Let's compare our creations side by side with the video from Major Lens. This is one of the slowest and laziest animals in the world. Meet the sloth, the cute slow motion furball. Sloths are a group of neotropical mammals with six different species. Did you know that pandas, despite being classified as carnivores, primarily eat bamboo? They can consume up to 40 pounds of bamboo per day. When you're satisfied with your video, go ahead and upload it to your YouTube channel. Remember, consistency is key for growth on YouTube, so make sure to upload your shorts regularly. Over time, your channel will begin to earn revenue. If you found this video helpful, please leave a like and subscribe to our channel. Your support is greatly appreciated.